Hi everyone, Shane Armon Rowe here. If you're a Steam Deck tinkerer, and you probably are if you're watching this channel, you know the importance of having a keyboard and mouse, well, at least a keyboard, when you're trying to do some very complex Steam Deck tutorials. I've got the cheapest possible Bluetooth keyboard on Amazon. It's $8. Let's hook it up and see just how well it works. Eight bucks to avoid a lot of stress and time. Sounds good to me. Stick around. All right, so let's take a look at this little guy. Um, the reason I got it is because it's small and thin, remarkably thin. Yes, this is one of the thinnest keyboards I have ever seen in my life. It's chiclet style. It does appear to be full size, or at least really close to full size. And there's very little to see on here outside of that there are function keys, command, control keys, and up here on the top, we have a charge light, a power light, a connection pairing button, and a physical on off switch, which is actually pretty good. Uh, you don't want this thing waking up in your bag and draining the battery. Of course, the bad side here is it is micro USB to charge, not USB-C. That kind of sucks. I would love to be done with micro USB completely, but unfortunately this is what we got. So we're gonna go ahead. This is the first time I've ever used it. We're doing it together for the first time. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on and we get a power light. And I'm assuming if I hold connect, I get a blinking, it looks like a Wi-Fi symbol, but it really probably isn't. Let's hop on the deck. And we'll go to settings and Bluetooth and we'll see if it happens to be here. Bluetooth keyboard, well, it doesn't get much better than that, right? So I'll hit Bluetooth keyboard. And what do we got? It doesn't show any light going on here, but does it work? Hey now, all right, cool. Well, that seems pretty easy and straightforward. Okay, so it's Bluetooth and we know that it works. <laughs> so let's go to our library here and let's just do a little bit of searching, right? Let's, uh, let's see how this works out, shall we? I'll just tap in the search and I'll search for uh, Mad Max. Oh, did I not have that? Yeah. Nice, well, that, uh, that was, it feels comfortable to type on. It's very, very thin, but the keys and whatnot are very responsive. Uh, let's see, um, Witcher 3. Of course, I can't. I'm typing at an angle, too. That doesn't help. All right. Uh, listen, it's a keyboard, but the real benefit of this is, is it's $8. Everybody can afford $8. If you have a $600 Steam Deck, you can afford an $8 keyboard to do these crazy tutorials like logging into Battle.net or logging into EA or all of these other apps that the on-screen keyboard simply does not work. $8, Amazon, I'll have a link in the description below. Uh, this is not a compensated endorsement. I paid a whole $8 for this. That's right, it. Uh, just a quick look, I wanted you guys to see that $8 could make your life a lot easier. Trackpad works fine for the mouse, but the on-screen keyboard, a complete mess. We know this. All right, I'm Shane Armonro. I hope you enjoyed looking at this $8 Bluetooth, highly thin keyboard. I'm Shane Armonro. Thanks always so much for watching and take care.